In the modern age of remote access, network security is a very important aspect of industrial controls. The XGB PLC allows the user to set up host tables that prevent unauthorized remote communication access to the information in the PLC. These host tables are lists of IP addresses that are allowed to access the Ethernet ports. Each Ethernet port has its own host table. By default, these host tables are disabled to allow any incoming IP address. Let's enable the host table for the internal Ethernet interface on our CPU. To do this, we double-click on the internal FENet network. This will open the standard settings screen for this interface. We can go to the Security Setting tab and check the box for Enable Host Table. We can then enter the IP address of any device we want to allow a connection for. Up to 16 IP addresses can be registered in each host table. Let's add the IP address of a GS20 variable frequency drive we have connected. If we select OK to accept the changes, we can write this to the PLC. It is important to note this applies to all incoming connections. The interface will still respond to a ping test, but it will not allow programming from a PC. It also won't allow access from an external device over Ethernet if the external device's IP address is not added to this list. In our example, we added the IP address of our drive, but we didn't add the IP address of our computer running XG5000. If we attempt to connect to the PLC using the Ethernet connection, we get a failed connecting to the PLC error, indicating the PLC refused the connection. In this case, the USB port on the CPU will still allow us to connect. To disable the host table, we connect to the PLC over USB or with an Ethernet device with an IP listed on the PLC's host table. Once we are connected, we can double-click on the Ethernet port with the host table we want to disable. This opens the same standard settings screen, and we can navigate to the Security Setting tab. If we uncheck the box for Enable Host Table and click OK, we can write the project to the CPU, and it will now accept access from any IP address via Ethernet. The Host Table is a great feature for network security applications where IP limiting is a necessity. It is important to take care to add all needed IP addresses. If we end up locking ourselves out of programming via Ethernet, the only way to recover is to connect to the PLC with an allowed IP or to physically connect a USB cable to the front of the CPU.